Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Big Pen Replace Pokemon Leaf Green Nuzlocke. So, last time was just a grind session. Now we're going to try and get through Viridian Forest and make our way to Brock. So, little heads up, this may be segmented into two things. Um, I gotta go somewhere in about 20 minutes. Wanted to just get started on this. So, we'll see where I am. If I'm through and ready for Brock, we may just cut it there. But we'll see what happens. Actually, let me make sure I have all the items I need. Uh, what was the pause? There we go. One antidote, two potions. But we don't have any money yet. I'm skipping the rival fight because of aforementioned reasons. So for the most because for the most part we should be pretty good. Maybe a couple more levels on um, Maybe one or two of them. But for the most part, we should be good to fight them. So we'll just take down the trainers from here. That should be good enough. Go! Come back, because that's going to take forever. String shot. You can slow him down, but you can never defeat him. Quick attack! That's just, that's pretty good. No poison, I don't want to have to use it already. Suck it up and start. Ah! Start using. Uh, Teresa against. the uh, Weedles. And Kukunas and whatnot. That's annoying. Well, since it's already. No, actually. Let's go ahead and call them out. Why, do, why does poison have to be such an annoying type for early game to deal with? Might run back and get one more antidote. Actually, yeah, we'll take down two trainers. And go stock up on supplies again. Because we are pretty low, actually. So I've been watching um, Team Four Stars Platinum does lock, and that's been kind of just <laughs> making me want to play more of this. I'll probably play one of the other things I'm doing sometime today or tomorrow. Just keep beating them down. Oh. Oh, okay. It's just hard in one. All right, we'll send it. Bludger. Well, it's proving to be a bit of a berserker. Maybe we'll get another crit. Hey, you do. Kick isn't really even the smart move anyway. Yeah, we may just have to let Leaf Seed do his thing. That's why I'm glad we have it. Makes a slow process slightly faster. Um, ba -da -ba -ba. Come on. I'll never understand what the developers were doing when they gave these to trainers. It's like, yeah, free XP, but at the same time, it's just like, we're literally just waiting for this to end. It's as unintuitive as it gets. Alright, bag. Where's that antidote? What do 
we got? This is an antidote. Oh, it is. Yay! Alright, do we want to go up and around or go back right now? I feel like there's a trainer up here, yeah. Alright. So we'll take this guy out. Go pick up some more items just to make sure we're nice and ready to deal with all them. Oh, it's a canopy. Okay, you can actually take that pretty easily. I can't wait till I get stuff like that. Oh, there it is! There's the crits! <laughs> this thing just gives crits left and right. I got like five when we were grinding or something like that. This thing does the damage. And when we get karate chop. Oh, it's gonna be interesting. Come on. Die. You want no match. You're at it. Two antidotes. Sheesh. We got the one, so. Now let's just go back and top up on health. I don't. I would just use potions, but we are running low on those. Just stuff in general. Maybe about a bit too many Pokeballs for early game. So yeah, about my absence. You basically, and I talked about this in the description with the Dissidia video I did, but basically the semester turned into a lot more difficult than I was supposed to. Because basically the syllabus said it was a lot of just papers and, you know, projects I could easily manage the time. But it also, you know, mentioned stuff like participation, you know, and all that kind of stuff. It doesn't say anything particular about assignments on most of them. Here's the thing. <laughs> Participation entailed those basic assignments. So I had basically walked into what it looked like, you know, it was pretty much, you know, a normal semester. It seemed all right. And then about halfway through, it really ramped up and I had basically more work than any I've had any other on any semester with a lot of projects as well as the normal workload. And then exams were around and midterms and all that nonsense. So I got bogged down for a really long time. But I got through it pretty good. 3.5 in the end. So that was pretty damn good, actually. Alright, I don't need to grind right now. Let's just get through the forest. Hello there. Did I fight you? Yes, I did. Right, that's the one I ran into while I was grinding. Kinda gave me a scare when that happened. I wasn't sure what the team was looking like. I was kinda just, you know, autopiloting. Alright, swap you out. It's weak enough for probably me to take care of it. It looks like this episode may be just me getting through Viridian Voice and then next time we'll battle Brock. Gotta make sure I keep a good time. Or it'll be two cuts half of Meridian Forest, the other half of it, and we're off of We should be able to get through this one. Nah, why is Poison City so weak? Alright, we're just gonna keep on with the front for now on, so we can, we can just get the swap out XP. It's so annoying. I just want it. Beedrill. You missed. I missed. Come on, Teresa, finish it up already. 
I've always liked Bulbasaur. I don't know what it is, but like, of the Gen 3, and of this kind of, like, of the first form, Bulbasaur is very much my favorite. But when it comes to the final, honestly, it swaps around a lot. I can never keep it straight. Sometimes it's Bulbasaur, sometimes it's Blastoise. Those two aren't the most prominent, but then sometimes it's Charizard. It's just like, I don't know. I can never keep my favorite Kanto starter straight. Oh, I forgot to swap them out. It doesn't matter. It's like a cool Weedle. Oh, wrong button. Uh, da, 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 da. Let me out, let me out. There we go. Put you up front. What are you looking at? You give me a Pokeball or something, right? No, you fight me. Why did I think you gave me something? Ah. Metapod. Maybe we can poison it. If not, we'll send in Teresa. Come on, give me that poison. Use a couple of poison stings, then we'll send Teresa set up leech seed. Take care of these slow. There we go, good job. Alright. Poison. Sting should be enough to just wait this out. I wish it, it would be kind of broke if these moves did the severe poisoning. In situations like this, I kind of wish they did. But then moves like Toxics would. Oh. Skin, that's right. Oh well, we'll just leave him Bumblebee. He's doing all right. Ah! This poor Metapod. It's tri wow. Twi twice on the dice roll for Shedskin. There's a crit. Another one? No, Canopy, you can stay in Bumblebee. It's a cocoon, it's not going anywhere, Caterpie. Oh man. We could have fed Butterfree and Beedrill. <laughs> Freaking Mankey! <laughs> Poor thing just had to go up against a Berserker. I was like, I was playing for it. I was playing around the lower defense, getting that heals up so I could guarantee it. And on the potion use, <laughs> there's the crit. Metapod. Oh well, Bumblebee's getting a nice bit of XP from the strainer at least. How long have I been going for? About 15 minutes. We gotta pick up the pace if we want to get through the forest in time. Poison it! Thankfully, uh, poison is still special. I don't remember if Poison Sink became physical when the special split happened. Or not the special split, the... Uh, physical and... What was it called? Um, you know what I mean. When uh, types weren't exclusively special attack or regular attack stat. Not that Poison Sting would have much relevance, but, you know. Who thought? Alright. Two more trainers, I think? One more... Hi, Pikachu. I fought a lot of you when we were training. Like, back to back, there was like three of them. Something like that. Having Pikachu would have been nice. We could have gotten Raichu. But, I mean, that was pretty unlikely. Of 
growl. I may just get everyone up to 10. Just so we don't have to grind as much moving towards, uh... Uh, what's... Mint? Is it Mount Moon? Yeah, Mount Moon is next, I think. Yeah, God, I haven't played this region in a while. And it's showing. <laughs> But yeah, so we'll grind everyone up to 10 after we get through Viridian Forest to fight Brock. Uh, what's everyone looking like? Put Casimir up up front. Give him a little XP. Academy, you can fight this without risk of poison. Oh, it's a tough one. String shot. You can't slow him down to the point of being faster than quick attack. You have no priority. Goodbye. Give me that XP. 37 is alright. Now we fight this guy. No rush, really. Actually, there is a bit of a time crunch, but we got three or four minutes before I gotta go. Weedle. Okay. And it's strong. Let's send it. Teresa, just play it safe. I don't want to risk a crit and poison. Just set up a leech seed and ride this out. Nice and simple. One of the reasons I really like Venusaur, though, is just how it plays. It's got really heavy bulk and can set up grip for a lot of sustain. It's just really hard to deal with without super effective moves. Especially in its mega form. Of the Megas, I don't know. I've never really thought about that. Honestly, I'd say it's a tie between Mega Blastoise and Mega Venusaur based on one, um, what I'm wanting to do. I do like Mega Charizard though, I like that. I like that Y gives it that really heavy fire utility and that X makes it a dragon. I just don't use Mega Charizard very often, so I don't know. I know Charizard, fine what, there we go. I know Charizard uh, Y is really good on Sun teams. But I like uh, the ability Charizard X gets. All right, and we're through Viridian. And with Vine Whip, we should definitely be ready for Brock. All right, still Route 2, so no new Pokemon. And we are at Pewter City. Neat. All right, let's see. Might as well call it there. Go pick up some items and then head on out. And then we'll fight Brock next time. Get everyone up to 10, and like I said, get everyone up to 10 just to get a jump start on the grinding. Go fight Brock. It's not that far off. I just like that nice, even level floor. Is there anything I can sell? Probably not. Uh, let's sell some Pokeballs. There's no way we're going to get six need six Pokeballs before we get some more money. We need a potion. And we'll need Paralyzed Seal soon. I'm just thinking ahead. Go ahead and grab another antidote. Alright. How did I run this low on money? Alright, I guess that's gonna be it for now. So yeah, next time we'll fight Brock. See you guys then.